So there's a strong emphasis between these two, this man and this woman, and they come through as a single unit. Usually it means that like these two people would have been so close in life that their relationship and the way that they would come through would be like one person. This is gonna get emotional, dude. And the question has been, are they together? Are they together? Are they together? And he's, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. I'm sorry. I just am having like an out of body experience. I feel like I just can't believe you. I understand. It's a lot to take in. But I want you to know that they're both coming through totally at ease and completely calm and at peace. And that's people's priority. Yeah. So please know that. Okay. So what was his name and what was her name? Hector and Debbie. Nice. They were very close family friends. Their son is like my brother. Well, that's the thing. Family is family. So yeah. It is what we make it. Thank you, these two people. How old were they when they passed? They were both, one was in their 70s, one was in their 50s. They're placing themselves away from, from other family, they're not around people that we're close to at the time of passing almost. The feeling is like they I feel- They were alone. That's a weird situation. It's a weird situation. It's like, really quickly, do you know who they were giving money to? Because this is so weird. <laughs> I just hit you. They would have been either loaning or giving to some extent like money. And the feeling is like this person just keeps taking and taking and taking and they do not know when to stop taking this money. Yeah. And I feel like there is just not a sense of full resolve with this person, but it had to have been for so much more than just uh, just like money. It's, it's more than that. They're just bringing up this very toxic person. This person was very manipulative as well mm -hmm. and knew exactly what to say and how to say it to get these things. <laughs>